Over the past few months, Manor Park slash OM have made headlines for their perceived involvement in a lot of different cases that have taken place in the London area. None probably more prolific than the incident where Drillford rapper Giddy, who's part of First, lost his life at a property in East London. Again, Manor Park slash OM have made national headlines way before this. In 2019, Drill rapper Farmer12, whose real name is Paulina Polo of Walton Road Manor Park, and is part of OM, was sentenced over the M of rival 18-year-old Amara Torre on June 30th, 2019, along with two other accomplices. That included dual rapper Snipes. Now the court heard on that Sunday evening, Farmer 12, Snipes and a few other friends had bumped into Amara Torre and his friends outside the chicken shop in the early hours of that morning. Now Farmer 12 and OM disliked anyone that could be from Newham, and anyone that could be remotely considered an opposition. Ever since their friend, 22-year-old Noor Salad, had lost his life via a blade and ammunition. Now both sets were already angry, disgruntled and hell-bent on proving who was the bigger threat. Amara Torre was considered an affiliate of the people responsible for Noor Salad's M. The influence of social media ensured that, that these two postcodes were not allowed to coexist, not allowed to be friendly or cordial. In essence, these two postcodes were not allowed to get along for fear of looking weak. Now during the scuffle, all people ran in different directions, but Farmer 12 and Snipes, whose real name is Dula Abdullah, chased Amara along Sutherland Walk, where Amara ran for his life. He ran so fast that he was panting and gasping for breath, trying to look for a way to escape. Sadly, he was caught. Amara had tried to enter a house but was blocked off by Snipes, and then the intent was immediate. Farmer 12 and Dula produced their blades. Amara was knifed once, twice, three times, four times, five times, six times, 17 times in total in a span of 45 seconds. Right there and then, four families' lives were forever changed, again in a span of 45 seconds. A lesser man would have given up right there and then, called it the end, but Amara's resolve to survive was so deep that even though he staggered backwards after the attack, he managed to flag down a passing car. He was immediately taken to hospital where sadly he was soon pronounced dead. Now it has to be said that Amara was unarmed at the time. He did defend himself to the very end and the whole incident was captured on a ring doorbell camera. When Farmer 12 and Snipes was detained, Snipes admitted that he was at the scene but blamed Farmer 12 for everything. Farmer 12, who was only 20 years old at the time, was sentenced to a minimum term of 23 years. Snipes, who was only 21 years old at the time, was sentenced to a minimum of 21 years. Condolences. Stay safe. Safe.